Yes, for this little music. <laughs> Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. She's a board certified dermatologist who's made it her mission to enhance the look and lives of women of color through safe cosmetic methods like laser treatment. She joins us now to break down the benefits of lasers and how it's best applied to black skin. Please welcome Dr. Della Michael. Yay! Hey, so nice to be here. It's so nice to have you here. Thank you so much for having oh me. Oh my God, we have so many questions um, because we know that black skin, well pigmented skin is mm -hmm. different from non-pigmented skin and there's such, there's so many um, different things that we have to take notice to. Yes. Um, so as a, cert a certified board dermatologist, what are some of the, the needs you notice for black women as it relates to skin and cosmetic enhancement? So one of the things that I've been working on over the last year is closing the knowledge gap mm. that there are treatments out there that are safe for people of color and they are available. Mm -hmm. They're at your board certified dermatologist's mm -hmm. office and they are very effective. Mm -hmm. Now it's no secret that there are some stereotypes and taboos in the black community yes. surrounding cosmetic enhancements. Now I personally, I get Botox. Okay. I have a good time with it on this line across my Wonderful. forehead. <laughs> um, in your experience, what are some of the myths surrounding lasers and black skin? I think the, the most important myth to debunk is that lasers are not safe for people of color. Ah. So there are a lot of lasers mm -hmm. that are safe for people of color. They're very effective mm -hmm. and I'm going to be showing one of them today. Oh, well let's start the demo. What, okay. what kind of lasers you got? Oh, so, we have a model. Yes. Okay, we have very good. So, so what? So this is the laser machine. Yes. What so, are some of the benefits of this laser? So treatment? this is the Aerolase Light Pod Neo. Uh -huh. And what I like about this laser is the wavelength that actually comes out of this laser is very safe for people of color for oh, darker okay. skin tones. And some of the benefits of this laser is it can be used for a lot of the treatments that women of color seek or uh -huh. even men of color. So things like acne. Yeah. Um, discoloration, which is very big. Mm -hmm. um, razor bumps. Mm -hmm saggy skin, mm -hmm. uh, wrinkles, mm -hmm. yes, and you know, we do get wrinkles. It may not be as deep as maybe Caucasians, yeah. but women of color also get wrinkles, so this is great for that. Mm -hmm. And what I like about this laser is it's very comfortable, mm -hmm. it's very safe, it sounds like a one blow dryer, it feels like a one blow dryer, it does not burn the skin. Now, Dr. Della Michael, what are some of the side effects that maybe um, women can kind of be apprehensive for, I mean, towards, I know that some people say they've been burned by lasers. Now, yes. what, in what instance um, would that happen? And how can we look for, you know, if we have to go to a dermatologist, and what can we look for? So the most important thing is that you find a board certified dermatologist who is very, very comfortable mm -hmm. with skin of color, mm -hmm. and someone who also has the equipments and the lasers that are safe for people of color. So mm -hmm. for me, I've actually invested in a lot of lasers that are safe for people of color. Mm -hmm. Now, there are cases where people have gotten burned in the uh -huh, past uh -huh. because they did not use the right product. Uh -huh. Okay, so show us how this would demonstrate, if you could demonstrate so, to us. So, you know, what, what I would do with this laser is mm -hmm. I would turn it on and uh -huh. then, you know, we would just basically do the treatment and just go over the skin. <laughs> Okay, go over the skin, usually yeah. in a basket weave manner. Mm -hmm. um, and she actually had the treatment um, a few days ago mm -hmm. and she can probably tell us a little bit about how that treatment felt to her skin. So, uh, Dr. Salisha Thompson, um, Hi. you look very glowy today. <laughs> Thank everybody, you very much. <laughs> this is my sister, yes, we look alike. Yes. <laughs> um, well, what do people say? Well, what did it do down to your skin? Well, Dr. Della Michael okay. knows I was very, very nervous. She was okay. very nervous, I was yes. Like a weirdo. Okay. So, what happened was, it felt warm mm -hmm. and like a blow dryer and and then I relaxed. So I had to, but she put goggles on me. She yes. covered up. Like. Yes, the goggles, this, this is very important. Uh, okay. Anytime we're doing laser treatment, we have to protect the eyes. The eyes. I'll model so she had on the goggles uh -huh. and that was really good because Salisha likes to talk and she <laughs> also makes all crazy. this facial expressions. So she had the goggles on so she couldn't really make those facial expressions that make me laugh. So, yeah. and she had the treatment. It so, was good. It so was how good. long does this treatment last? So this treatment, so once we do this, we're actually mm -hmm. activating the skin 
skin and the collagen mm -hmm. and the elastin mm -hmm. in the skin, so it lasts forever. Oh, wow, yes. do you have to get a bunch of them? I usually recommend a series of treatments mm -hmm. depending on what we're trying to treat. Mm -hmm. So in this particular case, she already has amazing skin, so we didn't really have to do too many treatments. But for her, if she really wants to enhance her look, mm -hmm. she can do a series of six treatments. Oh, so okay, so then once we get the laser treatment, what do we have to do to kind of maintain the benefits of that treatment? So the most important thing to do after the laser mm -hmm. treatment is to make sure you're investing in the right skincare products. Oh. So for Celicia, I use my skincare product, so this is the Intuitive Brightening Serum. Okay. And this serum is actually made for people of color because it addresses all the concerns that people of color uh -huh. have, so discoloration, large pores, acne. Mm -hmm. So I actually uh, went ahead and I put this on her skin mm -hmm. after the treatment. So I'm gonna be putting a little bit on again today. You don't need a lot of it, so just a little bit on her skin. And uh, I think she really enjoyed it. Do we have to have the laser treatment in order to use the serum? Because, you know, I like products. So, you know, you don't I have like to, to do have stuff. the laser treatment mm -hmm. to use a serum. The so serum sweet. actually helps to oh, it extend. it looks like glowing. It feels yes, so yeah, and it feels it's very up. soothing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so it's very soothing. What, what it does is it extends the lifetime of the mm -hmm. treatment. Um, so, yeah. Well, Dr. Delamichael, we I, thank you for joining us. This was so thank you so much for having me. I'm gonna come down to the New York and give me some laser treatment um, to get more skincare tips and to find out more about laser treatment do's and don'ts. Visit RadiantSkinNYC.com.